hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new here you are welcome my name is beauty Agbontai. so guys if today is your first time coming across my video maybe you have never seen me before and this is the first time you are seeing me please don't forget to hit the subscribe button like and also share and don't forget to turn on that bell so that anytime i upload any video you will be the first to know so guys today's video i'm going to be making breakfast it's saturday morning over here so i want to quickly make breakfast for my family so i'm going to be showing you guys what i'm going to be making I want to use potatoes and you know, and some bacon, you know, just to do it. So I will show you guys. So let's get started. So guys, these are all my ingredients which I'm going to be needing for this recipe. So over here, I have my bacon. I have 500 grams of bacon here. Here I have four potatoes, Irish potato, Irish uh, potatoes here. I have the greens. Uh, Bear, bear, bear. I have the yellow. I also have the red one here. Why over here I have ginger. I also have garlic. Why here is my you know olive oil. I have a black pepper here, salt and a one cube of non margin. So this is what I'm going to be needing. First of all, I'm going to start with peeling the Irish potato. So guys, I'm just going to start by peeling my potatoes my Irish potatoes then after peeling it I'm going to dice it into a cube so which I'm going to be showing later first of all now I'm just going to peel it so I'm going to demonstrate with the knife and also the the peeler I think the peeler is more you know we have this thing I have this thing which I normally use to peel my Irish potatoes which is very very good Yet with the knife, oh my god, you peel everything off. But with that pillar, it's very, very nice to peel your Irish potatoes. So I'm um, after after with this, I'm going to use that one to demonstrate again. You will see the difference that that one is more, you know, is the best when, when it comes to peeling of your Irish potatoes or you know, concuba or any other thing that can be peelable. Look at the one I peeled with knife. So let me use. So guys, this is my peeler. I bought this one from Lady in one of my vlog. I show you guys. If you are following my channel, you will see where I bought it. I bought it in Lady in one of my vlog. So I'm just going to use this one to. Just then I'll show you guys the end result of it. So guys, this is the one I've used my, you know, my peeler to peel. Why this one I use, I peel it with knife. You can see the difference. So this one is, you know, <laughs> it's more better. So what I'm going to do now, just to peel the rest of camera. So guys, I just finished with the peeling now. So what I'm going to do now is just to start to, you know, to shop it. I'm just going to demonstrate one or two while I do the rest of camera. So guys, this is how very tiny or not too tiny depends on the on the size you want. You can make it like a very tiny. You can So this is the size. This is the size I shop it in. So why I'm going to do the rest of camera. So guys, I just finished shopping all my veggies. So here over here I have everything. I have onions here, the red bell pepper, the green one, and the yellow one, and also my ginger and garlic. So what I'm going to be doing now is just to take my 
my high rich potatoes then i'm going to put it on my plate then put it in microwave for about three minutes so after three minutes i will show you guys guys the next stage now is to put my bacon on my hair fryer so i'm just going to open it then i'm going to put it in my air fryer because i don't want to fry it i want you know because it's already oil there's already oil you need so i want the hair fryer to drill out the excess oil on it so guys i just finished with my bacon look at it so i use my hair fryer so there are so many oil in, in there so there's no need of using oil so what i'm going to do now is just to drill the oil into my pan then after then turn on my gals Then I'm going to be adding my my Harris potatoes to it, guys. Remember that I didn't cook these Harris potatoes. I just, you know, use my microwave because I don't want it to over. I don't just to do it half done. So I'm going to let it sit for a few minutes before adding any other thing to it. At this stage guys, so I'm going to start adding my, my pepper I'm adding to it. Over here I have my black pepper and salt, so I'm going to add this. Why here is my curry powder, so I'm going to be adding half teaspoon of curry powder to it here is my onion powder which I'm also going to be adding half teaspoon to it here is my cayetano pepper so I'm going to be adding half teaspoon to it too Over here is my rosemary, so I'm going to be adding half teaspoon to it too. So guys, I'm going to turn, transfer it into a pot because it's, it's like it's too much for the pan. So I'm going to transfer it into a, into a bigger pot. So guys, what I'm going to be doing now is just to add my veggies to it. I'm going to start by adding my onions first. Then, you can also add carrot if you wish it. So I'm going to taste it now. So I have not added my mangi to it. So I'm going to add my one cube of no mangi to it. Guys, my kids love this. Oh my god, love this for breakfast, eh? Guys, it's about five minutes later, so I'm going to be adding my bacon to it now, which is the last. So this breakfast is very easy and delicious. My children like it. Anytime I make it, they are very, very happy. So in the next three minutes, it's done. Guys, this is the finishing part of it, guys. It looks so delicious. 
just try it and let me know let me know in your comments in the comment section below how does it taste when you try it thank you all and god bless you